Today, I will show you the only two ways to color grade F-Log2 correctly. Now, there's only two real ways to grade F-Log2 right now, and one of them is with LUTs. So you can download Fujifilm's LUTs. Once you have their LUTs, you'll see a bunch of ways to grade F-Log2. Here, I have another video on, on how to download the Fujifilm LUTs. So if you wanna watch that, watch that here. Once you have these LUTs and imported them, all you have to do is drag them, drop them on, and then bam you have a LUT for your F-Log2 footage that corrects it. Then you can adjust it however you want, like you can see here. So that is one way of correcting F-Log2 correctly. Now, the other way is with Dehancer. So you can drag that, drop it on, choose your camera, Fujifilm, and as you can see, if you drag down here, F-Log2, and you can choose which camera, they only have a few different models. So whichever one has F-Log2, that's the one you're gonna have to choose, and you can see it corrects it differently than it does with F-Log. Right off the bat, you might think, wow, this doesn't look that great, it's bad. Well, no, it's only because you have film stuff on. So as long as you check this off, like the grain and everything, it'll correct it in the correct way. You can also drag that up, bam. And now you have your footage pretty much corrected. And these are just film simulations, basically. You can choose which film you want to emulate. There's also one extra way you can correct it, but it takes more time and it's not as easy as this. So if you delete this dehancer, you can go to the transform, color space transform, drag it on. And as far as I know, it's still Rec 2020, so you can transform it like that. And you can go down to Fujifilm F-Log. But the problem with this is it's not F-Log 2, it's only F-Log. So you're going to have to play around with it to get the exact look you want because it's not going to be editing the curve in the correct way. Here you can see it looks great but that's because this is F-Log not F-Log 2 but if it was F-Log 2 it might look a little different and you'll have to like tweak the gamma, you'll have to tweak the offset, tweak the gain to really get what you really need. Now that you know how to correct F-Log 2 watch this video here on how to color grade your footage in a cinematic way.